I like audiences if they're alive. <laughs> I'm very not picky about audiences. You know, better if they're not sleeping, good if they're laughing, wonderful if they're applauding. Um, you know, so no, it doesn't matter. Obviously, you love speaking to women. You sort of go, oh, I get you. Um, but I love talking to young people because, you know, there's so much opportunity to connect there. But, you know, men are pretty fabulous too. Obviously not picky. Well, there are ways that, you know, you have to sort of take into account, you know, what's this gathering about? What are they hoping to learn? I mean, you know, one size doesn't necessarily fit all. Although, you know, what I know is what I know. So, you know, presumably if someone says, we'd like to hear what you have to say about, you know, stigma and mental illness or about, you know, what are the most important messages that you've learned from people or how you transition through life or, you know, what are the greatest places to travel, um, they won't want to hear that from me. So you tweak it, but presumably if someone says, we'd like to hear what you have to say, then you say it. I remember speaking to um, specialists who deal with uh, special needs offenders. These are people in the corrections institutions who suffer from mental illness. And I was doing my, you know, mental health speech, and I thought, you know, here I am. My my point of view is a fundraiser, volunteer, a mom, a you know, poster child kind of person. But my knowledge is, you know, not one tenth of what. They know, I mean, they deal with this, police workers, people who work in penal institutions, social workers, you know, frontline staff who are, you know, looking at cutting edge, you know, things, and they're dealing with mental illness all the time in our corrections. Um, I, was, I was a bit nervous about that. I really thought, like, what can I tell these people they don't know? And they gave me a standing ovation. I mean, I think what was important was to remind them also of the human side of things about what families go through and that sort of thing thing that was that was wonderful